morning everybody hope everybody's having a great Tuesday just thought I would uh, make a video haven't had a video in a while I'm gonna get my hot cup of joe and we'll go out to the train shed and do a layout update all right so with this update I'm just gonna do a total layout update and this is probably about 95% set in stone so right here I'm pretty sure I'm gonna put the engine facility and then I'll have a fuel and rack sanding towers and all and then out here is gonna be the yard so I could keep some of my rolling stock on the layout and over here there's going to be a lumber yard a wholesaler sells lumber and I think the track through the middle of the layout through the yard I believe it's going to go and connect over there in that corner so basically we'll just walk around so over here I'm gonna have a little town scene here and then coming around I'm gonna have a large area right in this area is going to be where the railroad museum is going to go and somewhere around in here I'm gonna have a scrap yard and then coming around Just staying with the front line. And that's going to be the main line. And it's just going to come around. And then in this area, I'm going to have docks like a port scene. And as it goes around, it'll go across the bay and it'll come around. And then the center of this area is going to be the, the lumber mill. And in the back corner is going to be a quarry. Well, not really a quarry, but where stone is shipped off and comes in by rail. And it's like a wholesaler, stone, gravel, limestone, whatever you want to call it. And then back here is going to be some sort of refinery. Ain't really came up with what it's going to be yet just another switching opportunity and then coming around the back it's going to come in and then I'm going to have some background buildings uh, one's going to be Pillsbury biscuit factory and maybe something else and then it comes around and then it's going to come into the town which is affiliated with the port right here it's going to be Port Summer is going to be the name of the port and it comes around there'll be a small station here at the city of Port Summer and then it'll come along and then this will be the intermodal yard I'm not sure if it's just gonna be a single track or a double track loading and unloading facility but as it comes around I'll probably put some background buildings and stuff in as we go along as money allows and then it comes back into the switch point into the yard and then back over to the yard just was a little brief update a lot of things have changed been buying a lot of different things basically just about all this rolling stock right here on this train is new either eBay or model train stuff got a pretty good bit scale trains boxcar but yeah it's what's been going on and train rooms about the same train still runs across the top which I'm going to probably try to put a video of that pretty soon of uh, I put my GoPro on the train 
running around the top. But that's all that's about been going on. So don't want to bore you too much. I guess I'll wrap this video up and talk to y'all next time. So, hope everybody enjoyed the video, and uh, hope to have a couple more videos of things going on. So, reasons for not really having much done with the layout. Uh, my wife's due with our third baby girl in about two weeks, and about five days ago I had surgery on my wrist. I had carpal tunnel release, and a cyst cut off the top of my wrist. So, with life and all the things that come, I ain't really have much time to spend on working on the layout. I hope to have much more in the future. So, happy model railroad and see you later.